Good evening. It's been a rather cloudy weekend, but it has been dry and it's been dry so far this year. In fact, we've only had around half the rainfall we would normally see so far in January. And with the high pressure still close by for the next couple of days, again, little sign of any rain. I mean, we do have some rain on this weather front towards the north, but just a few millimetres that will continue to give some rain here through the night and through tomorrow. To the south of that, where the cloud stays broken, temperatures are falling towards freezing, but it'll be a patchy frost and some patchy fog as well, but neither widespread, but certainly worth knowing about, ready for the morning rush. Otherwise, as I say, through the day, our weather front meanders a little bit further south towards Moray Firth, some brighter skies following, the fog clears away, the frost lifts, we could see some sunshine again, eastern Scotland, perhaps northeast England, parts of Northern Ireland, but again, in some areas, the clouds thicker, it could be really quite cold and gloomy, as we saw today, just four or five degrees in some areas, but eights and nines more generally and the winds easing off near that weather front in the north as well but that's still with us on Tuesday again just giving us some further outbreaks of mostly light rain across the north and west of Scotland that's where we're chasing that cloud around thick in some areas some patchy frost and fog in others and some sunshine coming through at times but predominantly dry and cloudy with that high pressure close by but midweek we might see a, a low pressure sweeping in with some rain in the northwest but starting to clear some holes in that cloud and allowing some sun I've met some of the most successful people in the whole world. They are miserable and they are dark and they are lost. We need some names. <laughs> no names, Louis. Put life on in the background with the Grounded with Louis Theroux podcast. Listen now on BBC Sounds. So how many of you have come to London looking for work? We were the lowest of the low. The thought went through my mind. You are being murdered by this man and you're going to die. This was a monstrous series of screw-ups. All those lives could have been saved. He gets so much voice. None of the victims have had a voice. The Nelson Files starts tomorrow at 9 on BBC Two and iPlayer. Listen up and listen up very carefully. BBC Three is now on TV. Oh my God. Come, let's do this thing. This is it. This is what I've been waiting for. Come on, Scott. It's time to strike a pose. That was cold. Check this out. This is my kind of party. Wild. This is total chaos. Work with it now. I kind of love that. Let's go upstairs. Yeah, boy! Yeah! Oh, oh, I want them to blow my socks off. Let's get gassed up. You cannot disappoint me. Yes. Yes. This is going to be brutal. Let's turn up the heat. Yes. <laughs> Together. We can change the world. Always leaving wanting more. BBC Three launches Tuesday, 1st of February. Get your football fix now on BBC One. Highlights from the Women's Super League as Brighton hosts the defending champions Chelsea. The Women's Football Show at 20 to midnight. First, all the best bits from the men's action. <laughs> 